Oh no, it's Norse. It's Norse. I forgot to have the record up as well before the previous match. So here we go, we can have the record on screen before the inevitable, inevitable loss. <laughs> yeah, Dev, yeah, like, it's, I've had some bad streams, haven't I? <laughs> right, could spend everything for the wizard. Uh, the Yeti's claw is not such a concern, is it? But he's got tackle and block and frenzy. Well, like, the block, is, the loads of block is a pain in the ass. The frenzy's a pain in the ass. Could just go. I like. I really like the money. I really like. I really like. A, I really like to save up for the apple. And uh, not apple. The third reroll. So maybe I just get the apples here, and then I still got some money for the reroll. And having an apple is, is helpful, isn't it? Not as helpful as a wizard. Blow it all in the waste, do you reckon? <sighs> don't know. Wish I had more than 50 seconds. I don't hate getting the apple. <laughs> Cause the wizard can just do nothing, whereas this can like stop a KO and keep us but then he's got to think about the wizard. Ugh, fuck it. Yeah, yeah fucking Norse. <laughs> of all the teams in Blood Bowl, fucking Norse. <laughs> Horrible. Yeah, that's true. All he can do is beat you up. Yeah, exactly. That, that's what I was thinking. That's why I went the apple. Um, no, Slanesh, there's no right or wrong. I prefer the apple just because you can use it on a KO, right? And then it affects that drive. Um, and there's also the, the old thing of the perception bias of every time you get two babes, you get cast. Um, and every time you get an apple you get KOs or I'm gonna receive and Daka. So like it's a bit I, pr I prefer the apple because you can use it on the yeah you can use it on a KO anyway But I think it's just I think it's just personal preference. I don't think that I'm definitely right to think that way. Or that you're definitely wrong. But I mean I do think you're wrong and I do think I'm right, but I don't think <laughs> I'm definitely right. <laughs> do you know what I mean? <laughs> like I still think I'm right, but otherwise I wouldn't do it, obviously. But I don't think it's it's cut and dried, you know, like for example not taking a thrower on an orc team or something like that. I can say the power up or yeah. Does the strength fall guy just get it? Oh I don't have the mighty blow, do I? Ugh. <laughs> yeah, true to hear yeah. I mean I'd, I'd I'd obviously prefer 
babes to an ego, you know, like I would never take, well not never, but I'd very, very, very rarely take an ego on, you know, a regen team. Um, so I'd definitely take the two babes over that. But I generally only take the, the babes on, on a regen team. Oh, the duck is, the duck is so much fun, isn't it? <laughs> Fucking cast him! <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> yes! Glorious! They were absolutely rock hard today, <laughs> and so was my cock. Didn't even kill him. What a joke. And I didn't discover it until people on Blood Bowl 2 talked about it. And it, it, it was Matt Dacker's invention, so it's it's incredible, isn't it? Yeah, the tree's gonna get claw mighty, isn't he? <laughs> Had you mentioned it before? Dio's Discord and stuff. That's that. You know, I'm sure it's Dio's Discord is where I heard about it. Um, the good thing is that after he doesn't, uh, you invented the fucking term, yeah. But you know, I'm sure that's where. Did you talk about it before you talked about it on Dio's Discord? Well, that's the thing, because I'm sure Dio's Discord, like you talking about it on Dio's Discord, is the first place that I saw it. Well, I didn't hear it until then. Sorry. Didn't even die. Glorious. He's going to foul him with his 11-man team. Well, 10-man team now as it is. <laughs> Get out of it. Yeah, fair enough here, Dev. You never mentioned it to me. <laughs> yeah, it's got the stars on. Yeah, very good. <laughs> Complete drivel. I just realised I shouldn't have got it on him, should I? I should have got it on someone who wanted to do passes on. Woo. I'm the best. <laughs> 
such skills. It does, doesn't it? Yeah, the DACA allows for maximum vanity passing. Yeah, it's brilliant. It's absolute genius. It's what it is. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's brilliant, isn't it? I don't really know uh, I Ravel. Um, <laughs> like, if if they hold the middle, then I, I guess, like, turn five or something, you start going forward. But I, I don't know. I'm a, I'm a beginner at this groundbreaking tactic. <laughs> yeah, it really reduces the attrition, doesn't it? That's the great thing. He just took he just took Blood Bowl to the next level, didn't he? That was the thing. He did you know, everyone says, Oh, if you're elves you try to minimize them to one blitz a turn. And it's like, no, he minimized it to zero blitzes a turn. <laughs> Absolute genius. So I guess next turn start going forward. <laughs> yeah, you can do it with throwers, yeah, you can do it with throwers, yeah. Maybe I should have gone back a bit further. Well, he's fucking idiotic then, isn't he, Dev? <laughs> yeah, there's, there is SPPs, but they've made a new stat, Zani Whoop, uh, called Passing Ability. And so rather than, you know, doing a quick pass on a 2+, plus, Elves will do a quick pass on a 4+. plus. So it's, it's massively... Passing is massively nerfed in Blood Bowl 3. <laughs> That's amazing, Jehanian. Is the kid that you got into Blood Bowl out of Miss Black? <laughs> oh, dear. It's a spot on assessment. Nobody can argue with that, can they?
He's a movement six now, so. I love that. I mean, you've got no idea what I'm doing with a Dakar. <laughs> I enjoy that. I enjoy that part of it immensely. <laughs> it's something a bit different, isn't it? I've just got no idea what I'm doing. Woo! Two levels. <laughs> Brilliant all done. Uh E A B can guess. Now it's not it's not you know, it it doesn't claim to be accurate or anything. But E A B can guess uh can guess nationalities. Let's do not use get his uh get his yeti away from the middle. Bastard. Knew I shouldn't have stood him up. <laughs> I don't know, David Lacko. I don't know <laughs> what the answer is. I don't know how to deck it properly, and I don't know how to answer a deck it properly. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping to learn both by this this wood elf run. I'm really hating this guy being movement six. It's surprising how bad it is. <laughs> Blodgy McBlodgerson. <laughs> That's fair enough, Ed, have you? Absolute madman counting squares, yeah. 
Everyone's going to be like that here, Dev, in uh, Blood Bowl 3, aren't they? Literally everybody. Because, um... Every, every dwarf runner will be movement 8 and strength or edge 4 or both or edge 5 or something stupid. It's going to be crazy. I think even if they do redrafts, every every runner will be like that. <laughs> uh, because they've changed the way leveling up is uh, is done. No, I, dwarves get it on with redrafts. Dwarves get it with redrafts anyway. So that's the beauty of dwarves. Movement eight. Movement eight at least, because you can keep them easily. Super easily. You can just cut down to like nothing as dwarves. Et ça passe le relais. Le ballon parvient à destination. L'attaque peut continuer. <laughs> I knew I'd instantly roll a one, so that's why I went with the, uh, the non loner first. Good. C'est toujours risqué de tout donner pour piquer un sprint. Wonderful. No hand are still just uh, done on the recipient's AG. <laughs> this is a scumbag bin max I'll be doing it anyway. Oh yeah. Yeah, it is, Jelly Oh, yeah, it is. But, you know, maybe I could have played it better or he could have played it worse or whatever. But it really does reduce the variance on how much damage you take, doesn't it? So, it's certainly got, it's certainly got upsides, hasn't it? Like I don't know how many hits he's made, but it's not too many. It's certainly not as many if he if he if he had been able to herb derp on turn one, right? Hello, Mardikista. Thank you very much. Yeah, it reduced the blocks received by a lot. Yeah, exactly. It reduced the blocks received. It reduces chance to high roll one blocks. Obviously, there was the chance of snaking with a bunch. There was a bunch of chances to snake at the end. 
Um, or just roll ones. But no, obviously it would be better with, with the new Blood Bowl 3 rules, right? When you could have used your reroll on that dodge, but then still had another reroll, another two rerolls for the dodge and GFIs from other players. So, um, so yeah, it really does. It really will be improved. Like, obviously, you won't have the you won't have the uh, farming, and obviously, got the SPPs as well from the farming the passes. Um, so yeah, yeah, being able to stack up, stack the rerolls on the crucial turn is really good. Absolutely. <laughs> Horrified. <laughs> right. I can go there, block him, blitz him, skull. He fucked it up. Too stupid, I don't know how to do it. I'm just gonna click at random. Oh good. I mean that was shit, wasn't it? <laughs> like that was fucking horribly unlucky, two one and nines. And if you'd played it properly, you would have probably been in a better spot to not have to make one in nines. But with Blood Bowl 3, you would have had, uh, you'd be able to reroll that as well. So that was, that was definitely unlucky, to be fair. One, making two blockless blocks and one in nining them both was definitely unlucky. He's only got ten. So that's nice. Like he's definitely only got ten. So yeah, it wasn't that bad, but it'd be nice to be able to use extra rerolls on that turn, wouldn't it, with the new rules? Eventually, yeah, Muppet, yeah, high TV teams are totally going to go for a bunch of re-rolls. It, it just depends. Like, it, you, can't, you can't answer any question anymore. That, that's, the, uh, that's the correct answer, is that you just literally can't answer any question anymore. Because it all depends on the format, you know, redrafts and the league system and everything it's just all situational so 
You just you just literally can't answer any question about anything. <laughs> Because there'll be different things for like, you know, fumbles, redraws. In real life, and just beat them to within an <laughs> inch of their fucking life. <laughs> Thanks, Bob. Um, yeah. Of course I am, Tony, um, if you invite me, yes. Thank you very much. Sorry, I kind of ignored it when you mentioned it. Um, but I am hyped, I did it. And you did beat me in the uh, Randor, didn't you? Did you? J5 beat me, didn't No, I beat J5. Did you beat me? I beat J5. Bezel beat me, didn't he? I won the last Randor one, didn't I? I won the last Randor one. Um, I'm pretty sure. Because I didn't understand the draft that we had to actually... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that we had. There was something, wasn't there? There was like a limited amount. Oh, it actually counted for TV, didn't it? It count, yeah. It counted for uh, it counted for the TV, and I didn't realize. I'm like, why is everyone? <laughs> I was like, well, there was a, there was either a cap or there was something. There was some kind of rules that I didn't know. I'm like, why is everyone taking these shitty players? I'm taking all the good ones, <laughs> and then I ended up with like eleven guys. <laughs> I completely, I completely had no idea what the rules were. <laughs> it's like, what are these people doing? Why would you take a block? Why would you take a block guy when you can have a block pass block guy? That's crazy. What's wrong with them? <laughs> there was a TV cap. <laughs> But then, luckily, I rolled three pluses. Yeah, I remember the J5 game where I fucking murdered everybody with high elves. <laughs> Just absolutely slaughtered. Slaughtered a chaos team with skillless high elves. Like, in terms of damage, it was skillless high elves. And there was, like, loads of mighty blows and claws. Just battered. Diced the ever-loving fuck out of J5. I remember that one. I also remember where I ran out of time against Devo and misclicked, which resulted in making the punt one square further, which meant that uh, it failed. And also, my shadowing was amazing in that match as well, funnily enough. Hey, he is a blitz. A blitz. <laughs> Get banged on. I don't know why I went that. I could just go around the other side. <laughs> Yeah, this is the opposite, yeah. Yeah, the TV cap, yeah, that threw me for a loop that. I just couldn't understand why you guys would, would like not taking the best players. I'm like, okay, it's not <laughs> it's not they're not very good skills, but they're better than not having them. <laughs> no, no they're not. <laughs> Exactly, Tom Schnees, yeah. Yeah, I had pity on him. I thought, poor, poor Norse coach. No need to torment him with a touchdown. <laughs> on your gravestone. 
<laughs> yeah, no, I just I just rolled badly on the Actually rolled well the, the crucial turn, or so I thought, on turn seven. Rolled well on turn seven and then rolled bad very badly on turn eight. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> oh no, Tony. Tony getting wrecked. Ah, oh, will I pull that? It was death. Just in case, you know, just in case uh, there's a touchdown. It's it's a free apple, isn't it? So, and you never know; he might fail the pick up or lose the ball or something. There's a chance he fails the pick up or loses the ball here. to go there. Fuck, I wanted to go through that square, block my own path. Maybe just base him. Hook dirt, base, base, base. Yes! <laughs> Fucking wrecked him. Oh dear, I see you're new to Blood Bowl fighting. Um, yeah, I, I know you believe there's a skill called Leap, but um, it's it requires a 3+, plus and while, while you may believe that a 3+, plus, um, has a 66% chance of success, it actually has a 0.001% chance of success. So you're better off uh, you're better off never ever 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 trying to ever roll any dice ever. <laughs> yeah, no, it could have lived. Could have left. I mean, really, I wanted. To, obviously, I wanted to uh, go through there, didn't I? Three plus two plus was with with dodge was the way. But I mean, I wasn't about to make a a worse play just because I goofed. But I definitely goofed. I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, but I mean, it was. I just got in the way. Like I could have done three plus dodges, couldn't I? But I just fucked it up. I fucked it up. 
But it's going to be real hard for him to protect the ball the next turn anyway, wasn't it? That was the thing. That was the glorious thing about this. Not glorious that you power me blodger. <laughs> yeah, blob skills, my blob. That was the uh, that was the more skillful part of the team so far. See? Three plus cast. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> he tried to roll a three plus, look what he got. <laughs> One <What an> idiot. <laughs> I don't know if I want to try and do the fucking pick up pass stupid play, probably not here. Just punching. Idiot nose. <laughs> no rushes there. I'm gonna find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their fucking life. Yeah, Bez Bezel beat me in. Uh, the, the reason that I didn't win the Rando tournament after beating J5 was Bezel beat me. And he had Kislev and he, he made his three pluses. And uh, while I'm sure I could have played better, um, that the t the secret to winning with Kislev is passing those three pluses. <laughs> yeah, running the fuck away. Glorious. Oh man, he's reduced to one D's. Beautiful. Okay, they still work, but it's still beautiful. Should I try to run up the score here? I don't think there's any need to, is there? Could even try some more uh, vanity passing. Not from J5 though. Guard line or could do some passes. Exactly, yeah, it'd have. Trying to roll a three plus. Oh, he got lucky, he didn't die. <laughs> lucky boy. <laughs> Avoiding death with that move. <laughs> Stop. 
stats on this team. Strength 4, Dance. He's appar he apparently <laughs> not so good at counting the number of blocks made. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, dear. That was disappointing, wasn't it? I probably don't even need to re-roll this either, but I'll do it anyway. him does he but allegedly gets in the way it is absolute madness more dear's lord yeah wins losses it's it's there on the screen uh blob skills four zero zero not going terribly might have to score next turn <laughs> but might not after scoring might he might he did a good job I thought first half of defending yeah it's funny how some people like the dice log don't they but I think it's pretty pointless but some people like it maybe I could move it across so that it's at the end of the dice log Right there. Yeah, some people do like the dice log. So the two options are two dice split somebody and uh, and try a stall or two dice some split somebody and score or surf <laughs> surf is sure hands guy on like a one D. Do the 1D and then blitz him. But I don't have no rerolls left. So I guess I've got to just 2D him. And score. Ooh, maybe another turn of stall with the uh, AV break. Like he's got nine men max. And all of his guys are tagged. And the ball's on a fucking strength four monster.
think the stun made me change my mind. I was ready to score, but I always could have taken the push, then the power, and then had an assist on the ball, couldn't I? Can't even get a surf. Unbelievable. I can't resist but correct him. got very unlucky on my score but hey let's not count that Fucking wanker. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> yes, never talk in chat is the uh, is the fast binder rule, but I prefer to ignore that rule and have a have a bit of fun sometimes. Have fun sometimes. Oh come off it with the double skulls. How many one in nines have been rolled this match? Lots. <laughs> the hell is Fudge Brander? I'm, I'm not going to try to reason with him. There's no, there's no reasoning with people like this, is there? Little bamboo, yeah. <laughs> Chris's claim was awesome, wasn't it? <laughs> Justice for little bamboo. <laughs> oh, that was brilliant. That was really brilliant. He's pretty salty. God, I love Norse tears. They're the best tears. You know, people are moaning about whether they're in tier 4 or whatever. Fucking Norse tears, the best tears. 
<laughs> Cry some more. <laughs> Oh, god damn it, I've got a dodge. I guess I don't have to dodge, I can just follow this guy. I'm gonna find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their fucking life. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Storm in the nuts. Ah, oh, I didn't even kill him. Never lucky. No, the tree had to make a three dice block with Mighty Blow. He wasn't going to foul, was he? Hello, Pedro. Merry Christmas to you, too. Even though it's not Christmas yet, but I guess it might be lots of people's last streams before Christmas. I did leave this uphill on for him. <laughs> oh dear. But it was worth it to get the foul in, wasn't it? This tree man is, is not a killer, is he? <laughs> yeah, Hans Gruber, what a legend. So yeah, it was a win for it was a win for the Dakar, wasn't it? Even even though the touchdown didn't happen, the Dakar itself was instrumental in avoiding damage. The first half. Yeah, pretty unlucky to not be two 0 really. No, on my luck, this fucking asshole. Will. Stop the score. <laughs> 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 I hope he's literally tearing his hair out. <laughs> no, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> BG <laughs> 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 
get banned for editing that video in real time. <coughs> oh, spreading good cheer amongst all men. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Volkaz, yeah, that's funny. Oh, dear. He was, he was a complete dick all the way through it, to be honest. All whined about the dice. There's just no, there's no fucking reason for it, is there, or excuse for it, so... Deserves a bit of a piss take, doesn't he? <coughs> oh dear. <coughs> yeah, it was the blitz of the fame. Yeah, that's all it was. That was the only thing that happened. <coughs> oh god. Right, so that's a oh, skill for Tony. A skill for squirrel. Not sure what to take on them. Uh, no, I've barely played goblins. Um, I've played something like six games with goblins. Uh, I, like, I like using good teams like goodies because being five and always more enjoyable than, <laughs> than struggling with goblins. I'm Jimmy Fantastic. I'm well known for how nice and friendly I am when playing Blood Bowl. Follow me on Twitch to learn how to play like me, a top coach with top positivity. <laughs> Thanks for that, Moradam. <coughs> oh, I'm, I'm really about to cough my guts out here. I'm better in the YouTube. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic. <laughs>